As you learn in the training mode, practice in the challenge mode, or take your official test, the process of submitting reports and getting access to your feedback report does not change. After going through each page on your clipboard and answering all the questions that are relevant to the specific house, you are now ready to submit your answers. After clicking the Submit Results button, you will be asked if you are ready to end the simulation. If you intentionally click the button, then click End and the simulation will complete the process. The next screen you will see is your feedback report. As a reminder, to pass the official test, you will need to receive 80% accuracy on the entire test. You can see your total score and your completion percentage at the bottom. This percentage is what needs to show at least 80% on test day. With that in mind, the feedback report becomes very helpful when practicing in the training and challenge mode. You should be striving to get over 80% on scenarios while practicing. By looking at each specific section, you can see which areas you need to practice in more. This data-driven approach can really help you target your weak spots so that you study and practice the right material. You can also expand the grade report to see the correct answers for every question in the practice and challenge modes. By reviewing your answers with the correct ones, you can use this as a teachable moment to better understand areas you need to work on. To be confident that you are ready to take the official test, it is a best practice to make sure you have received an 80% or more on multiple training and challenge scenarios. This shows you are familiar with the simulation and have an understanding of the material. I will though remind you that you are allotted multiple test access codes via ResNet. So if you do not pass the first time, all is not lost. But make sure you look at the feedback report if you do not pass the first time. See what areas you need to work on and practice those before you take the test next. Good luck!